Hey, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we are talking about buying a home in Chicago and when is the best time to do so. So buckle up, we're gonna dive into each one of the seasons and why we think that this special season is the best time to buy a property in Chicago. If this is your first time on our channel, thank you for being here. My name is Jordan Pyle. I run a real estate team called Pyle Residential downtown in the city of Chicago. We're gonna introduce you to another team member, Ryan Harmon, here in a little bit, but thank you for being here. If this video brings you any value, we'd love for you to leave a like, put a comment down below about any further questions you have about buying in Chicago and when might be the best time for you. Definitely hit the subscribe button before you go to make sure that you catch all of our future videos. So without further ado, let's jump on into the video. All right, so I get this question all the time and not every market in the US is like this, but Chicago just happens to be a seasonal market. And as I'm sure you've heard, uh, winters can be pretty brutal and the summers can be absolutely gorgeous. Uh, we actually just put out another video about the five pros and cons about living in Chicago. I'm gonna link that in the card below. So you can go check that out to learn a little bit more about things that we love about Chicago and the things that maybe we don't so much prefer. And a quick disclaimer before we jump on into the first of the seasons, which is gonna be the spring market, uh, the disclaimer is that the fact that we just had a global pandemic so a lot of what we're gonna be discussing is typically what we see in a normal year. So the pandemic in 2020 kind of threw some of the seasons for a loop. However, we're starting to see the more normal seasons come back around now that we're almost two years into this pandemic. So let's dive on into the spring market, which I'm sure you've probably heard is typically the busiest time of the year to buy a home in Chicago. So many people think that the spring market is April, May, and even into June, where we as real estate agents, we actually consider this and we advise that the spring market Market starts the first Monday after the new year. So it may still feel like the winter market, but from an activity standpoint, this is typically what we refer to as the spring market from January 7th through the end of May. So the obvious thing about the spring market, and I know you probably talked to some friends of yours or coworkers or even family members about them trying to buy a home in the spring over the last two years, and it's been very, very competitive. So the one part about the spring market is that while you might have the most amount of available inventory for you to choose from, you also have a lot more other buyers and competition going after those same homes. So the one thing that we want to stress about the spring market is although most people decide that that is the time that they want to move, you know, a lot of leases come due in the spring and Chicago is one of the most rent heavy cities in the US. So you can see how that lines up people trying to get in and under contract in February and March so that by the time their lease is in in May and June, they have secured and they're closed on their new property. So in order to be buying in the spring market, you just want to make sure that you're prepared. So reach out far in advance of when you actually want to go under contract and close on a property, get connected to the realtor and they're going to get you in touch with a really solid and reputable lender for you to get your pre-approval letter. The last thing we want is for us to get out, start looking at properties, and then you not be prepared when that dream property hits the market and we don't have your ducks in a row for you to actually be able to capitalize and purchase that home. But we do still think there's a better time of year to buy. So before we get into when we personally feel is the best time to buy a home in Chicago, I'm gonna turn it over to Ryan Harmon and he's gonna talk about the next two seasons of buying in Chicago and the pros and cons of each. So after the crazy spring market, we head into the summer market, which is June, July, and August. This summer we saw a crazy travel scene, which led to less demand on the houses that were on the market. And because of that lack of demand, these houses were staying on the market for longer than normal during the summer months that we were used to in the past. That being said, if it was a hot property, it was still gonna go fast. So in short, summer is still a great season to purchase in. You could still get a great deal because there's less competition out there for you to go against. So the next season we're gonna cover is winter. Winter in Chicago starts from Thanksgiving and goes all the way to the new year. In winter, you're obviously gonna see less inventory and less demand, but the inventory that you do see out there are highly motivated sellers. They're trying to get rid of that property before the new year. So as a buyer, you might find the right place at the right time and a seller who is highly motivated who will sell it at a lower price than they normally would in the spring, summer, or fall months. The only caveat to purchasing in the winter is the winter is cold and you will be moving in during the winter. So you always have to keep that in mind as well. All right, drum roll please. The best time of the year to buy a home in Chicago, in our personal opinion, is the fall market. The fall market is pretty much start of September, October, and up until Thanksgiving in November. 
So the reason we think this is the best time of the year to buy is because we typically are moving into a market. You know, people are now, kids are back in school. Um, you know, we see that some of the people that were unable to sell their homes in the spring and summer market, they now have accumulated a significant amount of days on the market, typically meaning that they're pretty motivated to sell if they're still listed for sale. So normally we see this time where a lot of the savvy buyers in our network that are more so buying, not necessarily from a state of emotion, but more from the way that the numbers work for their long-term investment goals. We see these buyers start entering the market in droves when it comes to the fall and even the beginning of the winter market. Um, and the reason for this, as Ryan just discussed, is anybody that's on the market, you know, into the holidays or you know, when the weather starts changing and football season's around, they're probably pretty motivated to get it sold before the end of the year. So as a buyer in the fall market, you can typically come in and have a lot more negotiation power. So savvy buyer or not, we think that the fall is the best time for you to buy in order to actually get a deal. And the best time to buy um, is not a one size fits all approach. So really everything taken into your consideration, you know, your motivation to purchase, your cash savings, you know, where you are in your family life and your personal life, all of these things are gonna determine what makes the most sense for you as it relates to the best time for you to buy. But statistically speaking, we find that the fall market typically is the most opportune time. And then in second place, we think that the spring market is the best time aside from the fall, just because of the fact that you start seeing the market shape up for the year, see a lot of inventory hit the market, but just know that you're gonna to have to be prepared and it's gonna be competitive. So our personal choice is to help our buyers navigate into the fall market so that we can secure you a better real estate investment. So thank you so much for tuning in. Those are the reasons that we feel fall is the best time of the year to buy a home in Chicago. However, as I just mentioned, there's a lot of other good times. So definitely reach out to us. Tell us a little bit more about what you're looking to accomplish and we can work together to determine the best time for you to buy. Thank you so much that this has been valuable to you. Leave a like, a comment, hit the subscribe button, and we'll see you on the next video.